you doing? Well, that's good. That is very good. Um, I'm glad you came today. So, I have a couple questions that I have already uh, written out for you. And I was just wondering if it's going to be okay that I could, you know, go through them all and uh, just ask you each question. They kind of get personal um, at some point, but in the beginning we're going to start out a little smaller, but... Okay. But yeah, how you doing? You doing, you doing okay? Okay. Yeah, perfect. So, uh, first thing, just so that for our records we can make sure that everything is uh, going going smoothly. Uh, first thing I'm going to ask for is your name. Perfect. And then last name. Awesome. And then, uh, what is your date of birth? Awesome. And then, uh, the year as well. Awesome. Okay. So then, uh, how old are you? I can't, I can't do that math that quickly. I need, I definitely need like 10 minutes to figure that out. Just tell me. Perfect. Okay. Awesome, okay. So that is good. Um, basically today, it, it's going to be low stress. It's going to be nice and simple. Um, the questions get a little too personal sometimes, or if they feel like they are, uh, you can just uh, let me know. But we're going to go through them together. I'll give you some time after each question to, to really think through your answer. Um, but yeah, if you don't mind, can we just get started? Awesome, okay. So, uh, we're just going to start out simple. Um, what is your favorite color? Perfect. Um, what is your favorite shape? Amazing. Um, next question. Who is your favorite relative and how many of your other relatives would you kill to see them stay alive? Okay. And what's the relation there? Awesome. Okay. That is good. That's a fun one. You get some surprising answers on that one. Um, okay. And next one, what is your favorite band or musical artist? Oh, that's a good one. I haven't, I haven't really gotten into them, but I've heard some of their big hits. Yeah. Um, okay. How many people have seen you emotionally naked? I see. Okay, and then uh, this one's easy. It's a true or false. What time is it? Nope. Sorry, yeah. Uh, usually there's no right or wrong answers, but... So, um, do you pronounce it tomato or like an idiot? Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Do you know how to type? Do you know how to spell business 
or definitely. Okay. Um, how many words does autocorrect fix when you're texting someone? Just on average, like a ratio, maybe. Okay. Um, do you remember the first question that I asked you? Nope, nope, that wasn't it. And if you don't believe me, you can you can rewind and find it. Okay. Do you think soulmates are real? Do you think that I'm your soulmate? Good answer. How many words are in the letter two? Can you tell that I left my razor at my girlfriend's house. And I haven't shaved my face for a good couple weeks. Can you tell that? Okay. Um, do you bite your nails? Or do you just hammer them in? Are you a can see or are you a uh, need glasses to see? Mm. Are my questions annoyingly misleading? I, I understand. Um, how many minutes do you think I spent on generating these questions? <laughs> okay, not that long. You obviously think that I uh, care way too much. Do you have issues objectifying objects? Hmm. What's something you want to learn or wish you were better at? Hmm. to uh, wish I was better at that. What is a typical... I'm so sorry. What does a typical day in your life look like? Okay.
Tobey Maguire, Andrew Garfield, or Tom Holland? Hmm. I'd have to agree with you on that one. Do you think that The Good Place is underrated, overrated, or underneath Michael B. Jordan? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh yes, these questions are very, very important. Do you own a Tesla, or are you a simp? Mm -hmm. Do you play any musical instruments? And if so, which one, or which ones? Are you one of those people who literally just said, my voice is my instrument? Mm -hmm. um, what percentage of your friends do you think that if you weren't around them, let's say at your job or at church, if you weren't around them, in those activities, would you not want to be friends with them? Yeah, just like a rough percentage. Okay. Really? Wow. It's a bit higher than usual. Are you responding to these questions out loud at the screen or just in your head? If you could just choose between having chocolate candy or fruit candy for the rest of your life, and not being able to switch, which one do you think you would choose? Mm. And what would you say to someone who would choose differently? Do you believe that you're self-aware? Do you believe that the others around you are self-aware? Does incorrect grammar bother us? If you had a different life, what would you change? Why don't you make those changes now? Mm-hmm. Mm. 
does silence make you uncomfortable? spell I cup well you really leaned into that one would you mind if I uh, read a bit of my poetry CGI am not. Does that make sense? Well, you know, it is a work in progress. Did it uh, bring about any emotions in you? Have you heard about our sponsor today, Honey? I'm just kidding. That that's never gonna happen. That'd be a really nice transition, though. Now I understand that this one's kind of sensitive, so if you don't want to answer, don't worry. But uh, Chris Rock or Will Smith? is 5 plus 3 times 0. I'll give you a minute to think about it. It's 5 times 3. 5. It's 5 plus 3 times 0. What does that equal? 5 plus 3 times 0. Nope. Nope, it's it's five. It equals five. Unfortunately, yeah, it equals five. What do you think the percentage is that I'm wearing pants now? Like right now in this moment? question for you. Have you ever tried to pop a zit that was on your butt 
but it hurt so bad that you almost threw up. Hmm. To be honest, the whole questionnaire is just for that one question. I need people to be honest. Hmm. Well, that is all my questions for today. Um, I might have a few more that I think of. If I will, I'll, uh, I'll give you another shout out and we can do this again. But thank you so much for actually answering all of these very... Um, honestly, I do have my notes, so um, I'm going to take a look at them and we'll see uh, if it means anything. We'll get your diagnosis out um, as soon as we can. And uh, I know your name and then your age and your birthday, so that's how I'll find you um, to give you your results. But you are free to go for today. Um, I hope that you have a good rest of your day. Do you have any questions for me? Nope, okay, no problem. Yeah, um, that is no biggie. So if, if that's all I can help you with today, uh, you're good to go. I will surely uh, get the results here and uh, I'll get back to you on that. Perfect, okay. We well, have a good rest of your day and uh, I pray that it uh, gets better for you or uh, if it's really good, that it stays good for you. And uh, I just hope that all is well. Thank you so much for coming to me coming to me today. Really appreciate it. Oh, this looks all good. This looks good. Okay. I'll see you later. Yeah. Bye. I bet they didn't even notice that I was switching pens. Probably not. Yeah. I think it. Uh, Psychopath is, I think, what the, you know, if they gave us enough of those answers, I think that's probably what it would be. I don't know, we'll see. We'll put it in the tester, yeah. <laughs>